Hey guys. So, just heading to the. Sorry, it should exist. Uh, as the right now. God, look at this car. Frozen solid. Um, it's actually not frozen. It's just war. Yeah, head to the edge now, pick up some things. Thought I'd take you so long. Uh, this is going to be stuff that. Um, for um, like next week because the middle of a deal load, well, not the middle, near the end of a deal load, and sorry, just put it in the car, there we go, uh, and at the end of the deal load, so a lot of this stuff won't be needing to get used. Um, so, yeah, that's the plan for today get the steps in. Uh, go shopping. I have got a camera. I'm now I'm using a Redmi phone just now because obviously my other phone gave up, so this is the new phone. Uh, but I also have the Sony A50 A5000 that I'm going to be using for future videos. I just need to get like memory card and figure out shooting and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, that's going to be fun. But. Hopefully this is enjoyable for you. It's just going to be a food shop um, in the ASDA, unless I get told not to film, but I don't think I will, so here we go. So far, um, my first option is oh, um, what them. Um, so first thing I got, blueberries. I have um, 100 grams of them every single day in a shake. Um, just gets that antioxidant set in. I like the as the special ones because they're bigger. I don't actually need as much of them um, to do the same job. Um, the other thing I've got, I've got so far, a piece of crispy salad. I have salad with every meal, uh, basically. Um, just adds some of these micronutrients that they kind of need. Um, also, I've got Pineapple fingers. Now, if these come in 200 gram packs, um, I usually have 100 grams post workout, so basically a pack gives me two days. Um, so I made sure the date covered the um, Monday and Tuesday because that's when I'll be using them. So, alright, so now it's just looking for chicken. Um, now I, do, I always do chicken breast fillets. Um, I buy a kilo at a time, just the normal as the ones. Um, that does me um, three days, I think it is. So it's not far, not far off um, the the full week. Um, also, you get. Uh, with the cutlers from Asda, you get 16 for 3 quid, so my missus says I'm wasteful, but I um, I just bend them after I use them, there's no point washing that shit. Um, right, so next on the list, I've got, I've got a couple So next on the list is just, um, well, we saw the behind this. So my stomach was gummed for absolute ages, and I didn't know why. So, Tried um, not taking milk, switched to almond milk, and that cleared it right up. So, I definitely think I've got a slight 
lactose intolerance. Um, so I've just been solely on almond milk for around a year. And um, it seems to have helped that. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you at the almond milk. I'll show you what I get. This is another thing that saves me. Um, Dilutin juice, I call it. Squash. Um, I have a lot, a lot of this. Uh, we've got peach. Mango fish, good enough. I get the ones that are no added sugar. A lot of fruit in them. These ones are quite good. Uh, mango, pa mango, apple and passion fruit. I just put these in my big jugs. On the day, I usually get two because I go through it quite a lot. Um, uh, what flavours? Uh, uh, I think I'll just get the one today. I think I've got one in the house. So, one thing I do get um, quite a lot, but um, I have it in some of my shakes is peanut butter. I actually use the Asda smooth peanut butter. I just like the consistency a bit better um, than the kind of more runny um, whole layer for your pit and nut. Right guys, so on almond milk, um, you've got your alpro. Um, so guys, you've got the alpro, okay? You've also got almond breeze. These taste basically the same. I just get whatever one's cheaper at the time. But it's almond breeze. So two of these. So you quick use for a lot of almond milk. There's not a lot of calories in it, so it, um, it lasts me a while. Well, I'm just going to find almonds. Right guys, so I usually have flaked almonds, but I've got chopped almonds here. Um, I put these in my salads. And um, it just kind of, it just helps things. I'm on a meal plan, so I follow everything that is set out on that. So, it's like less for me to think about. But, that's me um, for today. Things that I had in the house, I had like jasmine rice, um, mince, and eggs in the house already, so I didn't need to get any of them. Um, and also got my supplements that I do get from Pit Stop uh, Nutrition. Code Team Shop 10. So I kinda don't have to get a lot of supplements and all that from uh, shops anymore. Uh, but yeah, that's me. I'll show you how much this cost. Another thing I usually get is um, sorry, for post workout. I get cocoa pops. Now, this just helped me cave my sweet craving uh, a lot of the time, and the math and the change breakdown of them isn't that isn't that bad. So I, kept, so I kept forgetting um, to also have oats in the house, which on rest days I uh, usually have oats and whey as my last kind of meal. Um, so it's just the odd thing that I buy in kind of bulk that I don't need to buy on a weekly basis. Alright guys, so that was, I'd say, about, so these mentos, um, three days worth of food, uh, mostly. Um, so I'll put the a wee picture of the, the cost there. So I'm round about 40, 50 quid a week. Um, that's discounting the things that I already had in the house and the supplements. So I think all in, in a month, I am about 
200, about 200 a month for food supplements, um, which isn't too bad. But I hope you enjoyed. This is your notification to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Um, also, put your wee bell notification on because. Um, you can either do some of my content or get notifications of all of my content as soon as they drop um, which is usually a Wednesday at 6pm or a Sunday at 6pm depending when I've done the video um, yeah so I hope you enjoyed this um, if you want to see more of this leave a wee comment down below um, and yeah thanks for watching guys remember you're the